so here problems on elevation in boiling point so the question is given here so what is the question we will see here boiling point of benzene is 352.2 kelvin the boiling point of a solvent benzene here acting as a solvent is given as 352.2 kelvin the boiling point of solution prepared by dissolving 1.50 gram of solute they are given the mass of uh, weight of solute as 1.50 in 95 gram of benzene that is weight of solvent is 95 gram is 353 kelvin calculate the molar mass of the solute so kb that is ebullioscopic constant or elevation molar elevation constant for benzene they are given as 2.53 kelvin kg per mole now remember students they are given the boiling point of the solvent as well as solution kb they are given weight of solute and solvent they are given you have to calculate the molar mass so how to solve this one? now you see here delta tb is equal to t minus t not b tb minus t not b that is 353 minus 352.2 so the difference will be equal to 0 0.8 kelvin so this is the elevation in boiling point temperature that is 0 0.8 kelvin now we know the formula for molecular mass of solute that is m2 is equal to 1000 into kb that is the ebullioscopic constant into w2 that is weight of solute divided by delta tb into w1 that is weight of solvent so when i substitute these values so 1000 into kb the in the question they have given how much 2.53 so substitute 2.53 here and w2 weight of solute that is uh, they are given as 1.50 grams so substitute 1.50 grams and delta tb we have calculated here that is 0 0.8 kelvin into 95 so when i simplify this that is equal to 49.93 grams per mole so this will be molecular mass of the solute so i think the problems is very simple just you have to identify what to calculate the given things will be given sometimes they may give delta tb value directly or you, you have to use these values substitute simplify and you'll get the values of delta t now we go for the second type of problem that is uh, related to that of the same elevation in boiling point the question says that pure water boils at 373.1 kelvin calculate the boiling point of a solution prepared by dissolving 4.2 grams of urea in 35 grams of water and they are given the kb for value for water as 0 0.52 kelvin so here what are the given things pure water boils at 373 that is they are given as a t naught b value you have to calculate the boiling point of solution that is you have to calculate tb value or t value by preparing 4.2 this is nothing but your weight of solute and weight of solvent is 35 grams of water and they are given kb value so that is 0 0.52 kelvin kg per mole. and also my dear students one of the important thing for one marks question they will be asking is what is the si unit for molar elevation constant or ebullioscopic constant so the si unit for kb or ebullioscopic constant is kelvin kg per mole now we will proceed molar mass of urea that is solute there you have to calculate molar mass of urea that is solute that is 60 grams that is urea is nh2 co nh2 so when i substitute the values you will get 60 now what is the formula so earlier we used to take m2 here and delta tb but they have asked you to calculate delta tb so m2 will be coming here so 1000 into kb how much they are given 0 0.52 weight of solute they are given how much 4.2 grams and molecular mass of solute 60 grams and weight of solvent they are given as 35 so when i simplify this will be equal to 1.04 now remember that this is the value of delta tb elevation in boiling point but they have asked to calculate the temperature of pure solvent so here t minus we know that delta tb is equal to t minus t naught so what is the value of delta tb we have got 1.04 so 1.04 is equal to t minus t naught so if i simplify so if i simplify so t is will be equal to so and this is equal to 1.04 so t minus 373.1 why because 373 they are given already the pure water boils at 373 so substitute this value 
t minus the value of t naught is given that is equal to 1.04 therefore the value of t will be equal to 374.14 kelvin so this is the temperature what they have asked to calculate, calculate the boiling point of a solution so the temperature of a solution is how much 374.14 kelvin then similarly we will go for one more problem related to this that is uh, calculate the boiling point of a solution containing 0.456 gram of camphor carpura right so what we commonly called as right so whose molecular mass they are given as 152 dissolved in 31.4 gram of acetone whose boiling point they were given as 56.30 degree celsius the molar elevation constant that is a uh, kb is 17.2 degree celsius per 100 gram of acetone now this is a little bit different because molar elevation constant they used to give in kelvin kg per mole but they are given the molar elevation constant is 17.2 degree celsius per 100 gram of acetone now we'll see how to solve now as they are given molar elevation constant is 17.2 degree celsius per 100 gram of acetone that is kb is equal to 1.72 degree celsius per 100 gram of acetone so delta t is equal to 1000 into kb so kb 1.72 this will be equal to 1.72 earlier it was for 1000 grams so it is now 100 grams so 1.72 so into w2 weight of uh, solute they are given as 0 0.46 so here you can see 0 0.46 grams they are given of the camphor that is nothing but your solute divided by molecular mass of solute 31.4 into 152 they are given the molecular mass of a solute that is a camphor that is 152 so substitute these values that will be equal to 0 0.16 degree now remember this value is for we are calculated only delta tv now therefore boiling point of solution is equal to here we should the, this, the value given here is what the delta tv value we have got right so this is delta tv value so if i want the t value so what is the problem so we have to add delta t naught if i take towards this side then it will be plus so 56.30 this value they are given over they are given already so this value already they are given it is uh, for 17.2 degrees celsius is uh, 56.30 so for this the uh, so when i substitute the formula so here t will be equal to 56.30 plus 0 0.16 so how do we get this 0 0.16 degree so when i have simplified this value <coughs> so i got the value as what 10.16 so totally when i calculate this value will be equal to 56.46 degree celsius so i think you understood with the numerical problem with respect to this then we go for the fourth type so i'm solving here many problems students so that it will be easy for you right so the four problem states what a solution was prepared by dissolving 18 gram of glucose so glucose is a solute here and the solute w2 is 18 grams in 150 gram of water that is w1 is equal to 150 gram the resulting solution was found to be the resulting solution was found to be having boiling point 100.34 degrees celsius so the temperature they are given Calculate molar mass of solute that is nothing but glucose whose kb value is 0 0.51 that is unit is kelvin kg per mole now first they are given the two values of temperature that one is a uh, 100.34 degree celsius and one more is a uh, hmm. so 100.34 degree celsius so one is a uh, you add since it is given in degree celsius convert into kelvin so 373.34 minus the normal temperature of temperature in kelvin is 373 that is difference is equal to 0 0.34 kelvin so delta t value is 0 0.34 now you have to calculate the molecular mass of solute so molecular mass of solute will be equal to 1000 into kb value they, they are given that is uh, we will see what, what is the kb value that is 0 0.51 they are given into weight of solute delta tb value you have calculated 0 0.34 and w1 weight of solvent right so so substitute here values that is 1000 into kb 0 0.51 weight of solute uh, solvent they are given 18 delta tv 0 0.34 and weight of uh, uh, solvent here it is solute and here it is solvent 150 so when i simplify this will be equal to 180 so molecular mass of solute is equal to 180 grams per mole so 
my dear students i have solved four important problems related to that of uh, molecular mass of solute and uh, change in temperature that is delta tv there are two important formulas my dear students one is a uh, delta tv is equal to kb into m or molecular mass of solute is equal to 1000 into kb into weight of solute divided by elevation ebullioscopic constant or molar elevation constant into weight of solvent so based upon these two problem formulas there will be one three marks questions related to this right so i hope you understood with respect to this right so for the next class i am going to discuss with respect to the third type of collimator properties that is a depression in freezing constant so my dear students so if you have any doubts related to that of your uh, concepts of solution so please go to the previous videos so if you are thinking how to get the videos go to youtube type my name name suresh but videos you will get the link of solution chapters where you will be able to see the previous videos if you want regularly to get that videos so go for subscribe subscribe uh, button click it so that whenever i am going to upload the videos related to this chapter you will be directly getting the notification so my dear students hoping the best you have understood the concept so with this i stop the uh, chapter right in the next class we will be seeing with respect to uh, the third type of uh, collimator properties called as a uh, depression in freezing point so wish you all the best okay thank you